So here it is, perhaps the match of the day. Logan Smith has not lost in state this year. Defending state champion, Mike Sharon Killingly, also a champion, has only lost once as well. Oof. And they are at 113. Oh, Smith in quick on that low single. Can he finish into a double? Oh no, Sharon's got the good hips. Yeah, we're gonna, this is gonna be exciting. I can already tell. <laughs> Logan Smith is a hyper-aggressive wrestler. Sharon is as well. They both don't mind being up off their feet. Logan Smith pinned one of his opponents in nine seconds this year. Logan with two takedown. Father, father and son uh, combo, Brent Smith, senior and junior, Matt side, very excited. They uh, coached Logan through all the years. Seen Logan grow up. He was this good when he was five. <laughs> he was just one of those kids that you were like, wow, he has something. He's ahead two to one right now, and he's uh, trying to spin out of the front lock here. Sharon's by in control Sharon. of this, though. If he can spin behind, ooh, tried a little funk roll. You can see the energy in the gym picked up as well because they realize that they're seeing some very, very talented young men right now. Oh, look at the quickness of Smith. Ooh. This guy's moving a little bit quicker than those 285 pounders. <laughs> the, 280, the 285 pounders eat, eat sandwiches at lunch that these guys oh, have. Yeah. Sharon right now He's trying to stay low as Smith is very, very quick to those single legs. There's another one right there, single leg by Smith. Oh. There it is, takedown. Looks like Smith's, uh, he wants this. He's trying to finish out his uh, senior year. I know he's had some injuries in the past post seasons. He's trying to finish out strong. He wants to take home this open title. Yeah, the only thing missing from his resume is a state open championship. He hurt his ankle last year and decided not to not to wrestle in the open. And this is the year it's got it all working for him. He's wrestling is as good as he has ever wrestled right now. And he has a 4-2 lead, which he will take into the second period against Killingly senior Mike Sharon. And you know, when you get that open championship, those other notches on the belt, they don't seem to matter as much. So he he that's the big show. That's the real the real deal. You know, conferences and it's a to win a conference title is a very big deal, but even a class title, but the state open, it's the coveted prize of oh, so the state the, community. There's only there's only 14 of them. So there's only, you know, to say you're the best that you're weight amongst your the amongst everybody else is uh is and the there's ultimate no there's no question in it cuz it happened. The wrestling match happened, you won, your hand got raised. No one can say you know, like on a football field, oh, this guy dropped the ball or didn't pass it or missed the, missed the hit. But on wrestling, it's on you. They're in a 4-3 barn burner, but now oh. Smith with a beautiful job gets behind for the 6-3 lead. This is going to be a fun wrestling match. This is the type of wrestling that uh, keeps people on the edge of their seats. Yeah, you get the impression that one false move in either direction and you could see somebody on their back in a hurry. That's the case. I think Logan uh, Smith is pacing himself. He's gonna, he's gonna try to chip away at this lead. So you, far, there's really, really not much change though. You can tell he's very confident in his ability to take Sharon down because he's completely uh, allowing the escape so that he can get back to position because he feels that comfortable. Yeah. Doing a lot of dancing out here on the wrestling mat. See some wrestling. Under a minute here, 6-4, Smith on top. This has been where he has used his quickness to spin around. Ooh. Oh, beautifully Ooh. done. See, now Smith is under him, and you'd think Sharon's in the better position, but if Smith can control that elbow and that arm, he's actually in control. Got good leverage right now. If he can just, there it is. Oh, if he can his just. His head's on top now. But a little bit of a missed opportunity that time. I thought Smith was going to have an opportunity to sneak out and around. Oh, Sharon with the quick shot off the whistle. How Smith quick. capitalizes, big throw. Still nothing. 
We got a wrestling match here. I love it. Yeah, Smith wanted to go, wanted to go for the the big move right there, but Sharon was able to collapse. This is where Smith is so dangerous, though. So quick. We'll see if he can get some points before the end Ooh. of the period. We still got a whole period. There's only two uh, two two point differential in the score. Six four. We head into the third period. We asked Coach Labeef. I said, is Mikey Sharon going to be able to give this? I think this? Brent Smith's taken down. Oh, excuse me, Logan Smith. I asked Coach Labeef. I said, you're going to be able to make, is this going to be a match? And he said, yeah. No, he's like, my kid's going to, my kid's going to wrestle with him. So they really believed that the two of them were Well, they're both state champions. Matched. That's right. Yeah. You got you to figure they're both, uh, even if Logan Smith is the favorite, this kid knows that. And he's, he's trying to become the new favorite. We got an injured finger, Logan Smith. Now, I got to imagine, just like the bloody noses, the fingers have to just take an absolute beating out there wrestling. I mean, how many times do you pop, dislocate, and sprain a finger right in the middle of a match? A lot. You just got to wrestle through it. It's wrestling. This happens. The bloody noses, the, you get poked in the eye, you're going to get basically punched in the face, you're going to get black eyes, you're going to get bloody lips, bloody noses. You're going to break bones. But you live to fight another day. Sharon will be on top, Smith on the bottom with a two-point lead. Oh, quick, look at that. Oh. Look at the speed there by Smith, but nice job by Sharon holding on. She's on the hips, uh-oh, Sharon's in a good position here. Logan's moving, though. So quick. Got to figure uh, the crowd's uh, also cheering against anybody that's not killing Lee today <laughs> as, they're, as they're secure in the first place. Sharon's holding on here, though. Yeah. He's got to do more than hold on. He's got to, he can't just ride him out. He's got to turn him on his back if he wants to win. These killing Lee wrestlers, you know, not that Logan Smith has them, but the Sharon kid, just like Logan, they've been wrestling a very, very long time. They know what they're doing on top. Very methodical. They can get those pinpoints, but Logan Smith, again, just beautiful, beautiful escape. You have to mention the Sharons have been wrestling each other. They have their own, the Sharons are their own wrestling team. I don't even know why they're wearing a Killing Lee singlet. Should just say Sharon on it. Oh, nice takedown. Oh, right to the half. Smith's going nuts. He wants the pin. Got two near fall. And just like that, an 11-4 lead for Logan Smith. Oh, that's a takedown. They never went out of bounds. 11-5, Smith on top with just under a minute remaining here in the third period. Imploring Logan to finish what he started here. Sharon needs to make something happen here. He goes for the single. So quick is Smith, however. Here the crowd imploring Logan. Smith Stalemate. Yeah, with 37 well, seconds remaining, we got to get the main. Let's see if they're going to call it. They've been on that. Oh, oh, now they're stalling. I don't know about that call, but I mean, they're they're getting paid the big bucks, so we'll let them make the calls. 33 seconds and 11-5 lead for Logan Smith. Sharon, he kind of took Sharon oh. in. Now Smithson got him in good shape, though. Who's got the Who's got the advantage right now? No one. <laughs> well, now it now it's looking like Sharon. There's two. He's letting him up. He needs points. He's he needs to go throw. for a big throw. He's got to go for something big. Oh, he's going for just another reversal. Ten seconds remaining. Logan Smith trying to hold on. Sharon is out of gas as well, though. There he spins him over. But Logan Smith, a 12-7 win. Sports Doctor has Logan Smith. 113 pound champion Logan Smith from Waterford High School. Boy, you were ready. I saw you two hours ago, you were ready to go. You made a big move late in that match and it kind of gave you a little bit of breathing room out there. It did, I, well, I was confident for the match, but that definitely helped. Um, it was crazy, it just, it happened. And I couldn't be more happy with the end result. Yeah, so how, tough is, how tough is it to repeat as champion? It's very hard. Gotta always be grinding, which I always do. I rest in the off season, keep my cardio up. And it was an amazing feeling. Another senior going out in style. Good job out there. <laughs>